Hello and welcome back. This is Damien. And I have bad news. But I can't help it. It's um <laughs> it's just something that was out of my control with swapping computers. Uh <clears throat> as you can see, we're in Sanctuary. And we're on a new character. Her name is Renee, and she is an enclave officer. I'm gonna play her as an enclave which is almost as good as a raider. Um, and as soon as I can get her combat armor and some better clothing and stuff like that, she'll resemble more of an enclave type person. Uh, but for right now, um, that is what we have. Now I'll explain to you why. Uh, I know a lot of people would be disappointed because we not only did we have a screwed up raider playthrough but all the previous playthroughs that we were working on are toast um i'll do it from the raider standpoint for right now i came to sanctuary so i can make some ammo and uh, i couldn't load the build menu and then when i finally loaded the build menu there were there were entire areas missing from it so we had we had no uh, coherent build menu. Let me pull. Let me pull this up. All right. Like for here, you know, we have structures and then furniture and decorations. Well, furniture and decorations were gone, completely gone. They weren't. You, you couldn't get them to load at all. Um, and then uh, over here, the creation club and the project X and the cages and the raider stuff were all gone. So all we had, we had, we had structures, we had power, we had weapons, we had food, stores, and crafting, and that's it. Nothing else would load up within the build menus. Well, I could, I could technically keep doing a raider playthrough until we got to the settlements, and you know, once I have to capture settlements for raiders, then I have to build them up and defend them and all that good stuff. And with no way to build beds you can't make a settlement so i was like well i can i can keep going for a little while though and then you know of course like i said i went in i couldn't make any beds and then i tried to fill my water bottles and i couldn't build water bottles because the hollow tapes weren't loading so i could um uh, tweak out the cob water options or anything like that so basically the only thing i had in the game was a character and a map of places that i could go but i couldn't do anything so i was like all right well since i had to you know all the mods were taken out of the game and then they were all put back in the game and everything was screwed up i was like let me let me try a new game so i created renee and i i've been having a an enclave uh an enclave playthrough in mind for quite some time i haven't um i haven't put the enclave mod in the game they're still working on it and i don't know if i want to go that far uh i, I would i think i I'd rather just have her be an enclave member and then just build up the commonwealth as an enclave powerhouse basically uh instead of instead of getting the mod uh enclave rising and trying to work through it because the last time i got it oh it was so buggy but they've done a lot of work to it and um if you ever wanted to try playing it i would suggest doing so because you know it might be a lot of fun for you but i'm right now i'm at the point where i just want to make sure my mods are working and do an actual let's play that i can finish all the way through um and then while i'm doing that taking suggestions from people about future projects you know every time i start recording my uh my laptop does that usb error thing every time i don't know what it is uh we're not even connected to the laptop right now and uh that's just kind of irritating but oh uh, sorry that was off the subject but um so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna start this enclave let's play and the the good things are we've got our computer we don't ever have to change that right now at least for a few years we don't have to change that we got our mods i'm not going after any new mods and we've got most of them working now properly 
um, and the game is functioning just fine. So I don't see any issues. But I wanted to actually be the one to tell everyone that the other Let's Plays are done. Uh, I have one more video that I was able to get done on the Raider. But um, in the future, I'm not going to do one right now. I'm, I'm, I'm tired of uh, Nuka World at the moment. I'm not going to do a Raider playthrough right now. But there, it, it will be done in the future. Because I do want to go in there and actually be able to finish a Raider Let's Play because I was having a lot of fun, but you know, when mods kind of go south and all that stuff, it kind of, it kind of irritates you just a little bit and you know, but I mean, and again, I'm not blaming any, anyone. It's not anyone's fault. It's just, I had to swap computers. I had to get a new computer in here because the laptop just couldn't handle it uh, at the, at the pace that I was going. So, you know, those kind of things happen. Um, it's nobody's fault. And some people, you know, are upset about it. But, hey, it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? So, all that being said, with us having an enclave officer who looks like she just stepped out of a vault. Uh, let me let me go in. I'm going to... I did have to... Um, this airship captain's hat, I actually had to uh, use console commands to get it in uh, because I wanted, uh, you know, it's kind of like the commissars from Warhammer 40K, stuff like that. But for now, this is what she's, this is what she looks like. This is Renee. And uh, it's a new hairstyle mod that I was trying out. It looks pretty good, but eh, I'm afraid it's going to clip on some things, but we'll see. Um, but I was going for trying to make her look as sophisticated as possible because Enclave are not raiders. Uh, they're not, you know, they're not, um, um, I don't even know the word I was trying to think of, but they're not, uh, they're not scummy. Well, they are scummy people. That's not even a good, the Enclave is scum. They're fascist, but they they put it under a, a label of democracy kind of like the brotherhood uh which it's going to be interesting um to see what uh what faction she goes with oh uh, i do have a mod also that allows me whenever i get to the institute i can if my charisma is high enough i can talk father into not destroying the railroad and i can talk him into replacing maxon with a synth uh i can talk to the railroad um uh, and i can actually change the outcome of some things that's the, that the institute does in end game whereas in the vanilla version you take over the institute you can't change anything you're just a leader everybody's mad you've killed the railroad and the brotherhood and you can't go back from that i've never ever been happy with the outcomes from any faction so when i saw this mod i was like i'm gonna try this this mod out i'm gonna give it a go and that may actually be what i do because as an enclave, you know, I wouldn't necessarily want to destroy those those uh, factions. I would want to be able to manipulate those factions and subvert control over those factions to be able to um, to be able to um, you know have have a bigger power base. Have uh, you know? Because it, it would be awesome to come out as the leader of the institute and an enclave officer and have the brotherhood of steel at my beck and call you know i can throw a grenade down they can send a bird, a bird i can fly where we need to go i can get reinforcements you know i can i can use the brotherhood i can also since you know uh i have an alliance with the railroad and the scents are free um i could use their covert abilities you know some things like that that's what's role playing in my head so i went ahead and downloaded that mod and we'll see how it works out uh, but for now, I just wanted to bring everybody up to date. 
and uh if you're disappointed i, I truly am sorry uh, i'm not even i'm not being sarcastic or anything uh, i was enjoying the raider playthrough but i just cannot function in the game with all those problems i can't do it um so we're gonna start over we're, we're still fallout 4 because that's that's my jam you know uh my dog's coming in you can probably hear him but uh you know because i'm still fallout 4 and minecraft and world of warcraft and those are my games uh it's just we have to kind of start over slightly again but uh i swear to you we're gonna get a let's play done and this is gonna be the one because we're perfectly set for it but anyway my dog needs to go out so i'm gonna go ahead and end it here and i'll get this posted up uh under the new uh let's play and uh we'll we'll get some videos out and and get it rolling so thank you guys for watching i appreciate your support i will see you at the beginning of this uh let's play and uh you guys have a great day